Josh Jr. here with another quick, and I say quick, rock hunting adventure. So, where am I coming from? It's a secret. No, it's not. I'll tell you guys where it's at after I tell you something. First, the area I'm in right now, I've only been walking for about 10 minutes. Let me show you what I've found so far. This is about 10 minutes of walking. Found stuff that's been dry, up on the dry area. Stuff that's been down in the water, stuff that probably stay in the rock garden, and this one here deserves to get cleaned up and inspected thoroughly. So jasper, and agate, and petrified wood. So all three things that we typically find out here in the Willamette River, yes I said Willamette River, is here. So where am I at? Well, let me tell you something. No matter where you can get public access to this river, if you're willing to walk and get yourself wet and walk out here in this water up to knee deep, you're going to find yourself some material. I choose not to go out there, so this is just walking along the edge. We're only here for, for just a quick little stop, and I thought, you know, I'm going to stop here and I will share this spot with you. There. Those of you who know the Willamette River will know exactly where I'm at now. And is it the best place along the river? Heck no. But can material be found here? Yes, if you work for it. Just don't expect to walk along the, the bank here and reach down and pick up a bunch of stuff. That's not going to happen because this is a spot that's hit quite hard. Sorry for the wind noise, if there's any. So, you actually have to walk out here. And it's muddy. And it's slimy. But, for as far as you can walk, there's rocks out here. They're covered, they're nasty. But if you're willing to come out here and work for it, you should find some material. Mostly tumbler size, but you're going to find something. So, just to show you. And Mrs. Jaws Jr. is here. She's scratching and scraping and trying to find her own stuff as well. But for all those people out there who says, well, Jaws Jr. doesn't share his locations, go back and rewatch my videos. You will see I have disclosed all kinds of locations, everything from thunder eggs to petrified wood to agate to jasper. I've even given grid coordinates on to some places. And I've also told people if they want to know more to email me. And if it's on a spot that is, in my opinion, a public location, I will gladly give you a GPS coordinates. I'll give you a Google map so you don't even have to think about it. But, you also have to be willing to come out and work for it. Because the stuff here close, within about 15 feet out, you're not going to find much. You have to go out away from this bank here, about 15 feet. And then look what I find here. See? Even in a place that's beat pretty hard by people, you're still finding material. And today is a perfect, perfect rock counting day. And it's perfect because I found one, plus those few that's out there on my bag. It would be a good rock counting day if it didn't find anything. I left my uh, tool back there, and I believe there's a piece of jasper right there. Let me see if I can zoom in on it and be able to find it in my camera. There's too much glare here, I can't tell. 
But see, there's the Highway 20 bridge where it crosses from Albany into North Albany, from Lynn County to Benton County. On the other side of it's a park. Drive all the way to the end. Park underneath the bridge or near the bridge. Walk this direction. Walk off the trail. And down here on the water. One for the jar. That's Jasper, but I have a lot of that color, so that's going back. There is plenty of space around here to go walk. I guarantee if you'll walk in this area, and if you're persistent, and you clean a rock off, you'll find something. That I'm not going to keep. Small piece of red jasper. There was a chocolate jasper or a brown jasper. So there you go, everybody. Right here on the Wyman River, Wyman Valley, Oregon, Albany, Oregon, right there. North of Albany, that way. Corvallis, beyond that way. Plenty of spots to walk. I don't know what you will find. That's why you go rock hounding, is to come out and walk and explore. So there's a free location for everybody. 
and I guarantee it, this place will probably be overrun within two weeks after this video is released. But I'm proving a point that, you know, if you want to know the good rock hunting spots, you actually have to get out and work for it. And then you're going to be able to find the material that you're going to be able to get in my next video. You'll be surprised. So there you go, everybody. Quick video here, kind of a rant, kind of showing you some of the material we're getting here in such a short period of time. So just remember, everyone's life is an adventure. Then there's mine out here on the Willamette River in Albany, Oregon, just outside, just off of the Highway 20 Bridge. This is the Adventures of Josh Jr. Have a good one, everybody. See ya! Ha! Still fun rock counting out here.